Hey everyone, welcome to MedCare. We're located here in Columbus, Ohio. This is the headquarters for the company. Uh, they also have bases all over the state. And what we wanted to do with this virtual tour was take you on a tour of this building and so you can meet some of the people, see some of the things that go on here. Uh, so we're gonna start walking in this way. Uh, MedCare is actually located on the far west side of Columbus, right? Conveniently off of 270. So if you're not from the Columbus area and you need to come into town for some reason, super easy to get here. If you're in town, any highway can lead you here. And uh, I think you'll find your experience here at MedCare really cool. So let's go inside. So welcome inside the building. You can see here we have a huge lobby. Um, we have our, our social media. Make sure you follow us on social media. And we're gonna take you around the building, let you meet some people that work here at MedCare. But let's start off with Ricky Cole, who works in our business development department. Uh, I'm here to support the partners uh, at the ground level, uh, building relationships for the company's success, um, as well as uh, supporting those uh, EMTs and paramedics uh, and helping them uh, progress in their career. Uh, we're the folks that go out and build those relationships uh, for the success of the company. So as medical director, I view my role as making sure that we're helping to support you. And in turn, uh, we try to provide the latest in electronic patient records. We try to give you the latest tools um, to be able to perform your job at the highest capability. In return, we look for having crew members that are dedicated, hardworking, and are uh, really trying to work to the best of their ability. So one thing here at MedCare that makes us unique is that we really pride ourselves on having a good clinical ladder. So as we're associated with uh, MedFlight, we try to have people come in as an EMT and we want to make you maximize yourself as a clinician so we can train you uh, to become a paramedic uh, and upwards on the clinical ladder. We want you to be a career clinician here at MedCare and that's my role is to make sure that you can do exactly what you want to do. So at MedCare we're really proud of our fleet and we're really pl proud of the direction we're taking our fleet. Uh, we've invested millions of dollars into upgrading our fleet to make sure our partners have the best equipment possible. Uh, we really want them safe, we want them comfortable, and more importantly, we want our vehicles to be reliable. So we're really rotating through our fleet, making sure that uh, as much as possible, we have the best vehicles available for our partners to take out on the road and make sure that our customers are safe and comfortable as well. So the quicker response vehicles in MedCare are responsible for a couple of different uh, functions. Uh, first of all, they are really our first response in our 911 systems that we support, both in Pike County, Ohio and Marion County, Ohio. Uh, we have a paramedic staffed on these and they are fully equipped with ALS equipment. Uh, it allows them to get on the scene quickly, allows them to assess the uh, patient quickly, start treatment, uh, and also then upgrade a basic uh, EMT unit uh, into an ALS unit should we need to uh, provide ALS transportation to the hospital. The other reason uh, we have QRVs is in, for instance, in the Columbus market where we have a lot of crews working a lot of hospitals and a lot of facilities, is it allows our supervisors as well as other support staff to provide them supplies if they need it in the field to make sure that we're getting some work done up on the floor in preparation for our crews uh, and just make sure that they're supported. Uh, we want to make sure our partners feel a part of the bigger picture and they feel connected on a day-to-day -day basis. So these vehicles allow us to get out into the field and make sure that uh, the partners have what they need to get their job done. All right, hey, thanks for joining me. Um, I'm gonna give you a quick tour of the truck here. One of the main reasons we did this is they have a wider wheelbase here. So it actually gives you a smoother ride. It's more balanced. Um, and actually, once we get in the back, you'll see we actually have more room to move around. All right, welcome to the back of the truck. Um, so one thing I immediately fell in love with uh, with these new trucks is the tinted windows. Uh, for privacy and on the side there's actually a wrap so again just all that privacy you're getting um, really helps uh, make the patient feel more comfortable and uh, yeah it, it re it's really nice and it keeps the sun out this is great here you have all of this storage here um, whether you have patient belongings you need to store or you have your equipment you can shove it right here you've got your first in bag for your emergency runs 
Um, just really nice, easy access shelves right here. More uh, storage. Should even have an extra little storage bin down here. Here's our, our cots. Uh, we have power cots in all of our trucks, which is really, really nice, uh, especially for patients that can walk. You don't have to lift. You can uh, just lower the cot down and lift them up with, uh, with ease. And Another great thing about these trucks is just all of the room that you have back here. Remember I was talking about that wider wheelbase. So with that, you're getting a wider uh, space back here, uh, which is really nice. Uh, again, just to make the patient feel more comfortable and give the, the crew more room to work with. <laughs> One of the coolest, most simple things, uh, the cabinet lights. The cabinet lights are just such a, a nice thing. Um, help you help you see what you're trying to grab. So it's a great easy layout um, to help you just quickly access whatever you need. Um, and we always keep it stocked every morning. We, we check our truck, make sure that we have all the basic um, stuff. And it's nice because everything is labeled, uh, telling you how, what, how much of each piece of equipment you need in each um, area. So that way you know that you're stocked and ready to go. So under here, you actually have uh, more storage. Here we have our monitor, uh, really nice. Uh, we have these that help clip in the monitor to help keep equipment from running around loose. So much storage. Back here we have the adult airway cabinet. So again, just um, easy access. Uh, you know, your, your seating is right here at the head. So if they need oxygen or whatever, you have easy access, it's right here, quick grab. Back here uh, for our ALS units, uh, we keep our vent bags, uh, which also has our pumps in it uh, for any patients on ventilators or uh, getting some sort of me medication through a pump. Um, we also keep our drug bags back here. Yeah, <laughs> that's, that's the back of the truck. All right, now that we're in the front here, um, I'll show you some things that make it nice um, with these Dodge Rams. Uh, one, the room's not bad. Uh, we've got good storage for our equipment. Um, what is nice is we have easy access to our lights here, our modules, our sirens. Um, so here, you know, just a flip of a button. We've got all of our lights on. Um, we've got our sirens here. Um, again, easy access. It's right there. You don't have to take your eyes off the road. Uh, we got our radios right here um, to help communicate with dispatch. Uh, up here, we actually have MDTs, which actually help cut radio chatter. So there's not as much um, communication on the radio. This helps us communicate with dispatch, let them know when we're transporting and um, where we're at. Um, and also we get our run inf information over that as well so dispatch doesn't have to say everything over the air. All right, thanks for joining me on this tour of the truck and I hope you enjoy the rest of your tour of MedCare. And now that you've seen all this great information about MedCare, if you're interested, you can go to MedCare Ambulance, our website, um, and there's resources there that will show you how to apply and walk you through the steps. Um, so if you are a licensed EMT basic, EMT Advanced or Paramedic, you can go to that website and apply. We have a partner who is dedicated to recruitment and onboarding, so she makes every effort to reach out to candidates within 48 hours of their application. Um, and we'll reach out, see what you're interested in, understand your qualifications, um, and if selected, we will get you set up for an interview. Um, and these are virtual interviews so that you don't have to um, take as much time out of your schedule um, or fight Columbus traffic. Um, so we schedule that interview for you. Um, and then following your interview, if selected to proceed in the process, um, we will send information regarding background screens um, and pre-employment testing. And then once all of those are passed, then you are sent an offer letter um, and your start date is identified. We have plenty of opportunities um, for new hires no matter what their career aspirations are. So if someone is um, interested in entering in EMS um, but isn't licensed as a basic or a paramedic, um, we have offer EMT basic scholarships. Then if you're an EMT basic um, as well, we offer paramedic scholarships if you're interested in um, continuing your career um, clinically. Um, we also have base supervisors, um, and then we have 
um, operations managers as well. Um, so there's sort of a career level ladder if you're looking at going into more leadership role. Um, then if you're looking to continue on that clinical ladder, we have um, opportunities um, since we are wholly owned by MedFlight. Um, MedFlight employs paramedics and nurses as well. Um, to be a paramedic or a nurse at MedFlight, you do have to have a minimum of three years of experience. Um, or if you're interested in getting off the road, um, we have opportunities in MedCom, which is our dispatch center. Um, they are state of the art and dispatch for not only MedFlight and MedCare, um, but a number of other agencies as well that we provide services for. Um, and there are lots of career growth opportunities within MedCom as well. Um, so we really offer um, a lot of options for folks no matter where they're at in their career. If you're interested in applying and joining the MedCare team, um, please go to medcareambulance.org.